there's no reason not to be. There's nothing he can do, but now I, I gotta start making units in case he does try and attack. Go over the speed. Kinda getting that critical mass of mutas so where I can start doing turret damage. Again, going for the reactors. Hive tech ready. I'm not going to be able to break him or anything, unfortunately. So, yeah, I'm just going to get hive tech ready, and I'm not really going to make anything else while I save for hive, except some spines at these bases. Ironic that I just happened to catch his drop off guard. Destroyed another one. So it looks like he's getting drop play ready. That's why these overlords are over here. Spreading the creep. So far, so good for the most part. Not much he can... I don't like this, this positioning for his depots. Okay, so it looks like here comes his first big push. Oh, don't want him to. That couldn't have gone. I mean, that was. Uh, I was not going to toot my own horn a little bit. That was a beautiful flank. Kind of crushed that, I'd say. And he didn't destroy much creep either, which is a kind of a mistake by him. I did some of Greater Spire. Going to get some infestors now. I'm actually going to kind of go kill these lings. I don't need them. He's only got one one two. His upgrades are actually kind of bad. Come on, come on. Oops. So far I'm in a very good position, obviously. And my broodlords are about to get out. Well, he's already prepared for the broodlords though.
kind of got this game one easy. Like, I haven't even, like, used any of my... Got a bunch of... He doesn't even have a fourth. I mean, not much to say about this game, except once my mutas get there, this game is going to be officially over. I'm kind of surprised he's staying in this. If he holds this next attack, I'll be very impressed. Yeah, he was a little too passive this game, and he didn't drop yet. I expected him to drop by now. Oh, he might actually hold this. No, he won't. So expect a GG any time now. The upgrades are only 2-2 two, two and I'm 5-3 and GG. <laughs> Hydra suck. Especially in 1v1. Yeah, Hydra's really blow at this game. Um, if... I mean, if you... I mean, there's not much to say except Hydra's suck. I will, ne I will never go Hydra's... I try to avoid Hydra's altogether. They're just a bad unit in this game. Unfortunately. Especially in ZBT, I wouldn't try them. Uh, I think Mutas can be pretty good. I'm still messing with the style myself, to be honest, so I'm not sure. I'd rather go to Muta play than Infestors. I've always hated Infestors in ZVZ. Um, so I'm not sure yet. But I imagine... I think they're good. At least for map control and then transitioning. I think Mutas are viable. Uh, since uh, the stun isn't 8 seconds anymore, I don't think it's any different. Ads, I bet you're at a lower level than I am, though, too. It doesn't work. I would rather drop Banelings onto Marines than Hydras. Oh, Hydras? Oh, what would make Hydras viable? <laughs> I, n I don't know if you're trolling or not. Some people really believe what they say sometimes. Um, I don't know. I think if you made them like Brood War, they'd be viable. I mean, they're just so slow. I mean, I'm not very good at making balance suggestions. I I don't know what I'd do with them, but I do think they suck so much. Oops. I like spreading to the... N I like overlords getting their natural first.
Hopefully I get ZBT all day. That'd make me happy. So. What do you mean you can't get it to work? No, you have to open it yourself. You have to go file open in the emulator. That was stupido. Sorry, just my brother being retarded. He's not very good with computers in general. Anyway, so we're gonna do hatch first again. Hopefully we're cross positions again. Nope. Uh, it looks like he's gonna be two raxing me. Looks like it's probably on 11-11 all in. Uh, if this was cross positions, this would have been better, but kind of sucks it's not. Oh, oh, maybe it's not a T-Rex. Ah, I thought what? I thought my drone attacked first. Oops! Wow. Okay, I may already made quite a bit of mistakes this game. Losing that Overlord. Our drone. 